Are you a rat? A conniving creature hiding in the corners of the map? Well, if you are, you're in luck, because today I've got five rat strategies for you to try to catch your opponents completely off guard and send them into a rage when they watch the kill cam and see where they were killed from. This first rat strategy is for the office master bedroom site on Chalet, and you're just going to need to bring any operator with impact grenades. So, this is going to be to watch the office door walk in from balcony. Come down into kitchen and throw your first impact right here above the hatch. And then throw your second impact right there to open the hatch. And now you can watch the office walk in all the way from wine cellar. And trust me, no one is going to be expecting you to be two floors deep watching the office walk in this is such a dirty angle and also it's super hard to see because of the way the bars are they have to look straight down when they're walking in the door which no one is going to do and you're just going to get a crazy easy kill people love to smoke off the rotate and the piano door and then plant right here if they're not planting half wall so that's a very easy kill. I wouldn't go here right away, like at the beginning of the round. I would wait till they start opening up walls, bodies start dropping, whatever. Then you just wait right here, wait for someone. Extremely easy kill. I get a at least like once a match on Chalet. This one gets you a super. E so try this one out, and now let's move on to the next one. This next rat tastic strat is for the dorms kids site on Oregon. You can really do this with any operator, but I like to go pulse just for the information. So what you're going to be doing as pulse is running out on the people repelling up to big tower. Now the most common way people repel up to big tower is through this back wall. Let me just run out to show you. Your location because has been you cannot be seen from any exterior windows when repelling up this back wall. So they'll typically repel up to this window and use that top floor to take big tower control. What you're gonna do as pulse is just use your scanner to confirm you know, that they are repelling. You can also just use the sound cue of the repel. But pulse just lets you know exactly where they are and how many. Now come over to this door during prep phase and you're going to shoot it 19 times in different spots and what that's going to do is make it to where when the last you shoot it one more time it will instantly break and you can run out and get the big tower kill so watch so you're sitting with a pulse scanner you're waiting for them to repel as soon as you see them repel on the heartbeat or you hear the sound cue of the repel going up you just break this barricade and now you're out and you're getting the easy slam most likely they won't be like all the way up by the time you repel, but you'll know about where they're going to be based on, you know, when they repel and how soon you run out. But when you're repelled right here, it is very difficult to fight a downward angle, especially if as Pulse you wait like half a second, let them get halfway up the tower, then you run out, they are dead instantly. No way to counter this rat strategy. If you like this one, this next one is even more ready. This strat is for the command center server site on Nighthaven Labs. You're going to bring a frost with the bulletproof cam. And this one is so simple and you would be surprised how much it works. And what's even better about this strat is that there is no risk to you. You don't put yourself in harm's way whatsoever. All you're going to do during prep, put your bulletproof right against this shelf and then put a frost mat down right here long ways and then all you're going to be doing while the round is going on once they get the main wall you just start scanning them non-stop maybe even shoot at them with the bulletproof they're going to be like oh annoyed bulletproof and then come over here to smack it instantly hit the frost mat go down you're sitting in servers extremely easy finish for the frost mat kill you might think this strategy is so simple that it never works, but I promise you it works. Here's a clip of it right here. Come put your bullet, look Frost, put a Frost mat right here. Doc, put a bulletproof right here. Find down. Uh, the stature yeah. our main wall. He hit the Frost mat. Oh. That was such a smart play. So use this one in your next Nighthaven match. Now let's move on to possibly the rattiest strategy of them all. Okay, this strategy is 
absolutely disgusting and infuriates anyone that gets killed by it. This is going to be for the Armory Archive site on Border. You're going to go Mute or even Pulse. Any operator that has a shotgun and a nitro cell is what you want. Now, Pulse works well because he can see them, but if you have any type of other intel on your team, Mute should work just fine. So, during prep phase, you're going to come over into security, shotgun out the bottom of this wall, maybe even a little bit higher as well, and then you're going to shotgun out this floor that goes into customs. You hear them out here, you hear them on the armory balcony getting ready to get the wall you hear their little feet squiggling around you get it ready bang it flies out of the footholds all the way onto the bow back and as you can guess from your reaction no one is expecting a c4 to come out of the floor and destroy the horde breacher right here and as usual you can have someone playing security or have some kind of setup to distract them to where they're not you know, why would they come right here and look down into this hole? I have no clue. But you can cause some sort of distraction to make this even easier. You get the call that they're on the balcony. Very easy C4 kill coming from the first floor. No one's going to expect that. Now this list has been pretty defensive sided. So I think with this last rat strategy, we need something for the attackers. This last rat strat is going to be for the office site on the second floor of Skyscraper. You just need to bring any op with grenades. Let's let's go ahead and bring Gridlock since she just got her nades. Now this strat works best with a drone assisting you. So what I like to do is just throw a drone up onto this balcony and you can bring it. You don't even have to bring it into sight really. Just drone out. See if anyone, they usually have a shield right here. But you can see if anyone is playing on this hatch. Now normally this will be reinforced. But that doesn't matter because they're going to be laying on the hatch or laying next to the hatch in some shape or form someone will come to this exact spot in order to contest this window so you may have to wait for your teammates you cook your nade and then just toss it right next to the hatch bang easy kill now like i said the hatch nine times out of ten that's going to be reinforced but it doesn't matter the damage you do to the side of the hatch will spread to anyone on the hatch as well so you'll still get the kill there if that is the case and the best part about this grenade strategy is that there will be no ads's or omis down here if you want you can use your second drone to come right here and check if you like just to make sure you don't see anything around there but pretty much no one wastes utility down here so you don't have to worry about your grenade getting intercepted and now you have a nice free nade kill that you can get anytime you play skyscraper so that is it for the rat strategies everyone let me know what you thought of them let me know any more you have down in the comments if you guys like this i'll release even more i've got plenty of rat strategies in the vault that i'm more than willing to share with you guys thank you for watching and i'll see you next time